Hi, I'm Brenda Kreckler. I'm here today with my husband Mike and we are at Big Darby Creek uh, Covered Bridge and some people call it um, the North Lewisburg Covered Bridge but that's because the name of the road is the North Lewisburg. But anyhow, we're going to take a video of it and I hope you enjoy it. Have a great day. Thanks. The front end of the video is going to be about the new uh, our Big Darby Creek Covered Bridge built in 2006. The history of the old Covered Bridge is going to be presented to you uh, by pictures at the end of the five minute video. This is the new Big Darby Creek Covered Bridge built in 2007 has a shake roof and it has a window that extend, extends the full length of the uh, covered bridge it's a beautiful covered bridge it's a uh, 130 feet long and um, it has a partridge truss and we're going to show I'll show you that here in just a few minutes uh, initially, though, I wanted you to see the exterior of it and the um, cords and the, the decking underneath of it. The um, decking is, is, is going to be, show you, it's going to be laminated beams um, that are bolted from the bottom through the top of these laminated beams up to the cord, the lower cord of the truss itself. And <clears throat> I wanted to say that first because I'm gonna I'm gonna reiterate that with you uh, because it, it, it is kind of um, it is kind of impressive. It is uh, done through um, local engineering, uh, current engineering. But nonetheless, it is beautiful. It's all wood and steel with the bolts as well as uh, the iron uh, pins. And here you have the laminated beams that are supporting the deck of the covered bridge. And it is quite impressive. It could be 8 to 12 inches wide possibly 16. I did not measure it. I should, I'm going to have her carry a tape measure with me. And it is quite, uh, quite impressive. And those bolts go straight up to the top of the, the cord. Now here, this is where you see the partridge truss. I know that some people call it a modified Pratt truss. I understand why, but nonetheless, this is done the original way that uh, Partridge, uh, who did the, who built this original bridge, and it's quite spectacular. There's the roof, and the roof is uh, done well. It's brand new. It's a shake top roof. Here you're seeing the multiple pieces of the X panels with wood, and then they have the diagonal steel poles, and <clears throat> that are attached. And uh, in so these, this, these each side of the uh, truss is a cord. There's a cord on one side, cord on the other side. And here is the upper portion of it, which is absolutely stellar. They did such a perfect job in, in making this appear uh, to, and look and be structurally strong. It is available for uh, regular cars and it is just absolutely beautiful and across the across the board done a wonderful wonderful way now in the next part i'm going to present to you pictures of the original bridge that was built in 1873. this is the photograph that i took in 1980 in 1985-1986, when I was uh, 
doing our uh, book Covered Bridges today, and um, that that book was it has a pub date of 19, uh, 1989. Anyhow, I just wanted you to see the what it looked like as an original in comparison to the other cover bridge, the new cover bridge, um, how beautiful the new one is, how beautiful the original cover bridge was, and it is quite spectacular that Union County, County, Union County was able to create uh, this, uh, to rebuild, to, uh, uh, I, guess, I guess, a lot of people say it's, it's, kind of artificial it's not really a covered bridge but uh, I believe in historic covered bridges but I've got to tell you that um, the the new covered bridge is amazing now the next section that you're looking at the next photograph is the interior of the uh, Partridge Truss covered bridge and it is the original um, 19 and I'm sorry it was the original built in 1873 by Partridge and um, <clears throat> and it is it's done done very well it I do see that the X panels are shown here on a vertical plane that um, <clears throat> and on the new uh, 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 truss it is on a diagonal and that could be very why be why a lot of people are calling that a uh, modified Pratt uh, the different terminology different names for covered bridge uh, trusses can be uh, difficult <laughs> to uh, to examine sometimes but nonetheless this is what was built by uh, Reuben Partridge, and um, it is the original, and this, it shows the wood decking on it, and it is, it's, it's quite phenomenal, but uh, I just think that you, you need to make sure that when you are looking at the new cover bridge, 2007, is when they finalized it. It, it. I think it took 2006 to 2007, two years, to complete that covered bridge. It is very is spectacular in and of its own right, and um, it it has historic nature in that it looks like the Partridge Trust did the big Darby Creek, the original Darby Creek covered bridge. Anyhow, uh, thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed the video. hope you learned something from it. It was great fun for me. Have a great day. Thanks. Bye.